Ahmadinejad signs on as Dean of Students at Sarah Lawrence College. A fully leveled up video game character marvels at how far he's come. And the milk rushing through a jug handle is having the time of its life. If we didn't previously believe we were in the higher status position, seeing you planted there right now confirms it. This is The Onion Week in Review. This week, top executives from the U.S. financial sector announced they're about ready to ruin the world again. Representatives from all major banking and investment institutions said that more than enough time has passed since they last caused a major global economic meltdown and confirmed they're pretty much fully prepared to bring about a brand new worldwide financial crisis. We feel like we've given people enough time to get comfortable again. Consumer spending has increased, housing market has rebounded. So yeah, we're all set to go ahead and ruin the global economy again. A new study released this week confirmed that pregnant women can drink one bottle of wine a day as long as their fetus can hold its alcohol. Medical researchers said while they once strongly cautioned expectant mothers from ever drinking alcohol, it's fine for them to drink up to 750 milliliters of wine per day if the unborn child can, quote, handle its shit without getting too tipsy. Well, our studies have proven that as long as a fetus knows when to say when, a woman as far along as seven or eight months can have a full bottle of wine at night and be fine. Also, if your fetus has a high enough tolerance, you could throw in some mixed drinks, maybe even a few straight shots, no worries. McDonald's announced this week that the company is considering franchising restaurants after being family owned and operated for over 70 years. In a press conference Wednesday, company CEO Robert McDonald said that while the restaurant chain has long relied exclusively on McDonald family members to operate and serve food at their over 34,000 worldwide locations, they are slowly running out of relatives to fill new positions. People have come to expect to walk into a McDonald's anywhere and see a McDonald there, whether it's Daniel McDonald in Grand Rapids, or Shark McDonald in Mumbai, or even my cousin here at Tomo McDonald. In Tokyo. Franchising will be a change, but people can still expect the same McDonald's family recipes that, that they've come to love. And in local news, a kidnapping is going pretty smoothly. In other news, ecstatic American Indians praise the Lone Ranger for finally telling their story. Michelle Obama is seen outside walking the family rhinoceros, and a man refers to his trust fund as savings. You will now hear three gong strikes and a recitation of the great chant before being ushered to the hallowed garden. For more, keep checking theonion.com.